And uh, maybe the most powerful thing Joan ever did for us is every night at the dinner table, she'd look around at her kids and simply say, tell me something good that happened today. And as simple as that sounds, it really changed the energy in the room. Because we, we may have had a day where our dad was yelling a lot, or one of my older brothers was in some trouble, or um, it was a chaotic house. But she got everyone zoomed in quickly. And if you share one highlight, it kind of brings momentum to a conversation. She did that for us throughout our childhood. And it's something we actually apply to life is good and work all the time. Because if you start meetings asking people what's going wrong, believe me, they'll tell you. And there goes the momentum right out of the meeting. On the other hand, if you ask just for one highlight, something that's a positive uh, note about their department, anything about the company, it really can get the momentum rolling, and then anything is possible. We found that to really hold true in our business lives. So this is like the recurring theme you'll hear throughout our story. It really isn't about always having the answers. It's about staying open and listening. And pretty soon we realized we have a pretty cool job. What we need to do is just listen to what people love to do and then help them celebrate that. And whether people love to hike or hang out with their dog or do yoga or play guitar, we can celebrate all those things. And as long as we kept listening, the business started to grow under our feet. Anyone who thinks they're going to grow a business on their own these days isn't really paying attention. It has been all, become all about, about collaboration, connection, partnership, and also transparency. It, it, transparency is key right now, and no longer can any brand put up a billboard of what they want the world to think they are and really be something different behind the scenes because consumers are smarter, they have the info, and they will call brands out and take them down so fast. And that's a good thing for business and the world. And uh, on the flip side of that, if your aim is true, if your mission is real, if you're actually trying to do something good in the world, people will actually overlook your mistakes, and our customers do it all the time. They, they call out things we're doing wrong, but they help us build the business together. And that is based on them believing and knowing that, that uh, the mission is authentic.